In this video, we're gonna talk about how you can find candidates for free on LinkedIn. Hey, what's up YouTube? It's Natasha, the business recruiter. Welcome to my channel. So I know we've talked about LinkedIn a lot on my YouTube channel and it's because it is a very powerful tool. And typically when I'm talking about LinkedIn, I'm talking about it in terms of LinkedIn sales navigator. There's a lot of different features and filters that are associated with LinkedIn sales navigator, but it's important to keep in mind that that is actually the paid version of LinkedIn. So with that being stated, there are a couple options that you do have out there in terms of being able to use LinkedIn for free and still being able to find top quality candidates. And when you have very niche or specialized roles, these ways are actually going to come in handy for you, especially if you're in a position where you can't necessarily afford LinkedIn Sales Navigator right now. And while the price of LinkedIn Sales Navigator is still not as steep as LinkedIn Recruiter or even LinkedIn Recruiter Lite, it's important for you to have a couple different ways of going about finding candidates in your back pocket. So with that being stated, we're gonna go ahead and jump into a screen share so I can show you exactly what I'm talking about. And before we do that, be sure to go down below and hit that subscribe button as well as that bell so that you can get notified of all of my videos that do drop weekly. Okay, so as you can see, we are actually on the homepage for Google and you're probably wondering, well, why exactly are we not on the LinkedIn webpage? Well, this is because there's actually ways that you can go about searching LinkedIn without even having to be on the LinkedIn page. And one of those ways is to actually leverage Boolean strings. Boolean strings help you to narrow down your search in terms of candidates to make sure it's targeted on the exact things that you're looking for in terms of that requisition that you're looking to fill and the qualities that you're going to want to be associated with that candidate. And when I say qualities, it's more so along the lines of the skill set that that candidate will have. So for this example, we're actually going to go ahead and say that we're searching for a tech recruiter who has some sort of experience with recruiting engineers or developers, anyone basically within the broader tech community. So what we're going to go ahead and do is actually put our Boolean string into our Google search. And let me just take a couple seconds to break this down. So the first part of our Boolean string here has the site identified. And this is gonna be important because you wanna tell the Boolean string exactly where you wanna search for your candidates. In this case, it's gonna be LinkedIn. The second piece of this is actually going to be associated with the type of role that you're looking for. Again, we're looking for someone who is in recruiting and recruiting can have a bunch of different titles. So we've included most of them here. Uh, so we're looking for someone who is recruiter or recruiting or recruitment or even talent acquisition because we know that they're all related in terms of job titles and what we're looking for. In addition to that, we also want to make sure that we narrow down the fact that we are looking for someone who is going to have a technical background in terms of recruiting. So we're going to make sure that we include that within our search. So we have technical or tech or engineer or developer or programmer. We know that those are sort of all of the tech skills that are gonna be associated with someone who has experience in terms of tech recruiting. So then once we have our Boolean string in there, we're just gonna go ahead and hit enter. And then Google is gonna do exactly what it needs to do in terms of us being able to populate some results that are gonna be associated with tech recruiters. Now, as you can see, it does have at the top just a couple individuals who fit those technical recruiter profiles. But what we're actually looking for is exact match so if you actually scroll down, what you'll notice is that there are actually names of technical recruiters that are listed here based on the search criteria that you enter with your Boolean string. So if we click on this individual, for example, we can see that they are actually a technical recruiter in the San Francisco Bay Area. And then if we scroll down, we have all of the information in regards to their background. Now keep in mind that I am not actually logged on to LinkedIn at this point, meaning that I am actually being able to view this candidate for free. I'm not on LinkedIn's homepage. I'm not within any of LinkedIn's paid products but that Boolean string was able to give me information in regards to this individual who potentially could be a good match for the requisition that I'm looking for in terms of a technical recruiter. And if we go back, 
We'll also notice that there are a couple other names that were listed. So we have this individual here who's currently a technical recruiter at Uber. Again, this is just one way that you can go about finding candidates who are targeted in terms of the job requisition and the specific skill set that you're looking for without actually having to have any paid version of LinkedIn. And again, note that there are a bunch of different ways in regards to how you can go about this. You can actually use Boolean strings within the LinkedIn platform in order to target your search even further if you do have an account or if you do have a paid version of LinkedIn. I hope that you found this video to be helpful. If you did, then be sure to give me a thumbs up as well as do not forget about my Facebook group because we're in there talking all things recruiting. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.